Hey there, welcome back to Coding Stuff and this is 12th part of our Instag blog app and in this video we will retrieve the username and user profile in our comment activity and if you like the tutorials you can subscribe to channel that will encourage me to make more tutorials ok so previously in the post adapter we have retrieved the username and user profile uh, over here so we are running firestore query inside the adapter so our adapter is a bit heavy so it can cause the performance issue so for the comments activity we will not do that uh, we will create another class another model class and we will name it as users and in this class we will just have two parameters so private string we have the image okay so let me check in the users okay, over here so image and name string image and name and we'll generate the getters so right click and generate hit on the getters select both click on ok so inside the comments activity we'll create another list so private list and this will be type of users we'll name it as user list and we'll just initialize it so user list equals to new array list and we'll pass that in our adapter so user list and in adapter we'll just receive that so over here we'll create another list a private list users is a list so list users and user list this dot user list equals to user list and in our comments activity so as soon as we retrieve the comments uh, over here we will first get the current user id uh, let me show you in the group so we'll first retrieve the user id okay let me show you in our post we have this comments and inside the document we have this user so we'll just get this user first and then we'll just access this user's collection and we'll pass the document as user id because we have stored the document as user current user id and we'll get this image and name so profile pic and username so just create here string user id and then document change dot get document dot get string and we'll specify the field as a user in the post inside the comments you can see the user field so that's why this is user okay then what we'll do We'll run the Firestore query. So Firestore dot collection dot users and then document and we'll pass this user ID and then we'll write dot get. So we want this just one time. So that's why we are not applying snapshot listener here. Then add on complete listener. Sorry. Add on complete listener, new on complete listener. And here we'll check if the task is successful or else we'll just display the exception to fix what went wrong. Task dot get exception dot get message and put semicolon over here. So if this task is successful, then we'll create instance of our users class. So user users equals to task dot get results dot to object and we'll pass in our users model class and we'll just add this to our user list so user list dot add and users so let me show you in the setup activity over here save to fast to 
okay so in this method you can see we have created the firestore collection as a users and then we have passed this uid so this uid was this uid you can see auth dot get current user dot get uid so that's what we want that is the current user id then just after adding this we can just copy this two lines and as soon as this uh, user list has been added we'll also add the comments to our m list so this will not take a lot of time so as soon as this user list has been added uh, we will see our list as well and in our comments adapter what we'll do we'll first collect this so this is circle image view and this is the text view so circle image view let us name it as circle image view or profile pic you can write and the text we will write here so I am user name so we will create two methods so public void set and username we will pass in the string username and then we will find its id first so m username equals to m view dot find view by id r dot id dot it was username so comment user this one and we'll just set this so m username dot set text and this will be username okay so after this we'll create another method so public void set the circle image view and we'll pass in the string profile pick so circle image view close to m view dot find view by id r dot id dot of comment profile pick this one and then we'll use the glide library so glide with context and then dot load the profile pick dot into our target is circle image view okay so in on bind view folder we'll create one users object so user users equals to this user list dot get and we'll pass in the position then we'll call our holder so holder dot set m username and then we'll call this users dot get name and then holder dot set circle image view and we'll pass in the users dot get image so this will retrieve the username and the profile pic of the user who has commented so i will hit on the run button and we'll check if it's working or not so it is installed and i will hit on this comments there's no comment uh, let me write something so as you can see uh, the profile pic and the username has been retrieved really fast as soon as the comment has been retrieved the profile pic and the username has been retrieved at the same time let me just comment on this so yeah it's working now what we'll do uh, let me just add another post here I'll hit on the crop and and I'll hit on the add post. Okay, so this has been added. I'll hit like. So as you can see, the profile pic is not being retrieved uh, really fast. So what we have done uh, with our comments adapter to set the profile pic and the username we can do that with our with our post adapter as well so we'll improve the performance of our app as well so i'll just close this all stuff and in our post adapter and i will open the main activity 
so here similarly we'll create one user list so private list this will be users and we'll name it user list and we'll initialize it over here so user list equals to new or a list and we'll pass in our user list over here and in the adapter we'll just receive that first So list users and user list so this dot user list equals to user list and then in main activity when we retrieve this post okay so over here we'll run the same query so faster dot collection users dot document and we need to retrieve the current user id first so string or that can be post user id so this will come from doc dot get document dot get string and this will be user so we'll pass in over here so post user id dot get and we'll add complete listener so new on complete listener and again we'll check if the task is successful also we'll do the error handling post so if the task is successful we'll create users instance so users users equals to this task dot get results dot to object and we'll pass in our users class dot class and we'll add this to user list so users list dot add and we'll pass in the users and again similarly we'll just copy this cut this and paste it over here okay so now in our adapter we don't need the file store users query so we'll just uh, delete this stuff from here this one also and also we don't need this user id so we'll just delete this We'll write here user list dot get will pass in the position dot get name and put semicolon then user list sorry dot get the position and dot get image so this will fix our performance so we are running five store queries in our adapter and our adapter is getting heavy because of that so we just have removed the one flash to query and that will improve the performance so i will hit on this run button and we'll again check the performance okay so profile is being retrieved really fast you can see there is no lag while retrieving the profile pic okay so that's it for this video in the next video we'll implement the delete feature so do subscribe and thank you for watching